Hi Aquarius, this is Jackie Tomlin. This is your general reading for the week of August 29th, 2022. Thank you guys for stopping by. Uh, if you're seeking a personal reading, it is JackieTomlin.com. This is the week. Let's see what we have going on. New beginnings, uh, getting what you want, a good business deal. Some kind of confirmation is coming into you this week. Something you suspected will be confirmed. It's also a week of putting a stop to anyone that is using you. Two energies here. Libra and a Pisces may or may not resonate. And there is a caution to slow down. Now that's whether you're in a vehicle, at home, or at work. So Aquarius, let's see, your first card up. Two of Cups reuniting with someone. This is the couple's card. Could be date night. We have the Seven of Cups, which means there's options available to you in all areas. Lots of options. And a lot of this is what you've been manifesting all year is actually coming into fruition now. Okay. And then we have the Four of Wands. Looks like a relationship coming up. Okay, the, a lot of you, this is going to be something new. If you're in a relationship, you're actually ascending to another level. For some of you, it could be engagement or marriage. Two of Wands coming in, making travel plans, probably working in that last minute summer vacation. We have the Two of Pentacles in the center of the reading. If you've been juggling financially, like borrowing from Peter to pay Paul, or perhaps what we have going on here is you're just a little bit out of your comfort zone financially. This tells me it's temporary. There's some new money coming into play. And with that, we have the death card energy. Now, this is endings, closures, rebirths, and new beginnings. So, one door closes, one door opens. And it's going to be very, very powerful, uh, very strong, very emotional. Uh, for whatever reason, if anything jumps out in your reading, I will say it if I've got fishing. I don't know if you're in a fishing tournament or what you're doing there with fishing, but it's going to be successful. With that, we have the King of Swords, Libra type energy. This is someone older than you, someone coming in to offer you some wise advice or some um, unexpected offer of help that you could really use. And we have the Empress card, Mother card, uh, positive changes on the home front, as well as the Six of Pentacles. Just as I said, there's some kind of money coming in to restore your financial balance. Now, not only is your financial balance going to be restored, it shows that you're actually going to be able to help someone else else out financially here in the next few weeks so aquarius let's move forward with these messages all right we have the ten of wands kind of like king of the mountain this is overcoming your obstacles pushing them to the side starting a new path a better path and the right path for you okay and on that Seven of Cups, we have the Hermit. There it is, the right path. Okay, you may, it may, you may not feel it. You may feel that things are a little bit off. You are on the path that is less traveled, but it is indicating it is the right path. On the Four of Wands, we have the Queen of Wands. Okay, and the Queen of Wands is coming in. This is a Leo energy. Okay, and with that Leo energy, it's... Grounded, center, taking care of yourself, being true to yourself. On the Two of Wands, we have the Emperor. Dominant, prominent, take charge type person. This is someone coming in to save the day. And then in the center of the reading is the Nine of Swords. Be warned of that loss of sleep. You're up in your, in your head and you're keeping yourself up. Okay. On that Death card energy, we have the Six of Cups. Part of the new beginning is going to be with someone from your past. And before you're ready to shoot the messenger, yes, you are happy to reconnect with this person. Okay? And for some of you, a Pisces really shines through there. On the Knight of Swords, there is the Nine of Wands. That's that Vajiggity card. This says, because of that Death card energy, you are anxious and excited and overwhelmed. And you have this wave of emotions going on at one time. And just know it's going to be very normal. On the Empress, there is the Three of Swords. Be warned. Third person. Third party. Unwanted advice and opinions. Bottom line, someone is trying to put their nose in your business. Okay? 
And on the Six of Pentacles, we have the Knight of Swords. Quick moving energy. What is rushing in here is that Six of Swords. Okay, they're leaving the trouble waters and heading into the calm. And your bonus card for the center of the reading is the Two of Swords. Two of Swords says, Aquarius, you've got decisions to put off that you've been putting off for too long. So this is the week to do so. Thank you guys for watching. Please give me the thumbs up. It helps the channel out tremendously. Take the time to like, share, subscribe, and hit that notification bell. Also, uh, if you're seeking a personal reading, it is JackieTomlin.com. You guys have a fantastic week, and I'll see you soon. Bye.